Let's take a look at some of KidBlog's new features. And this is KidBlog.org and you can easily create a class at KidBlog.org in their new screen by just clicking create a class and once you click create a class you are taken to a very easy registration page you can sign up with your Google account if you like or you can just add your own information your display name and password and email and um, go down and add your class name and then put in your verification code and click create class and you're up and running and now I'm logged in um, or not logged in but I have been taken to a class I've already created and I have four classes so I have Mr. Barnes period two and now I'm gonna log in and what's great and this works for students too once they are registered when you go to the class you just click a drop down menu you find your name and all students will as well put your password in and log in and from there you are taken back to your class and you can go to your uh, control panel and dashboard and this is where as a teacher you'll spend a great deal of time you can review posts you can review comments from students you can approve them uh, lots of things that you can do so uh, again I'm in the general setting and now what I want to do is I want to get a code for my students to register for my class and this is one of the best new features of KidBlog uh, I'm going to allow it. Users can join class using code, and I want to click yes. And then look at this powerful feature here. I'm going to click to add it to a projector. Now I can put this on a whiteboard for my students, and all they have to do is copy that down. They go to kidblog.org and click on the secret code. And once they click onto the secret code, they're taken to enter your class registration code. They type this in and then from there all they're gonna do is click join class and now since I'm logged in I'll be taken back to my control panel but for students they'll get a very simple registration pass uh, or screen where they can add in a display name and a password and uh, it's very easy to do now then students can do a lot of what you can do they can change their theme they can change their profile uh, KidBlog has great new features so uh, this is KidBlog Give it a try.